we ended up with a country that said, people in Borno are in the same country as people in Ebaland, and they are in the same country as people in Oiri. And that artificial imagined country only came into existence, well, 100 years ago next year, and that country is insufficiently imagined. We don't have a way of really talking about what it means when we say we're Nigerian. And so, how would we have an instinctive way of defending the idea of Nigeria? It's an imagined community that is insufficiently imagined. So the problem is not in our culture, but the problem is in a way related to colonialism, in that it has sort of pushed us all together and we still don't know how to make sense of that.